This is a really simple word of encouragement for anyone who may be struggling with receiving the love of God. I want to share with you something the Father shared with me to help me better understand who He is. Let's first look at 1 John 4, 8. It reads, Anyone who does not love does not know God, because God is love. And what I want to highlight here is that God is love. Now, let's go to 1 Corinthians 13. We're going to read verses 4 through 8. And it says, Love is patient. Love is kind. It does not envy. It does not boast. It is not proud. It does not dishonor others. It is not self-seeking. It's not easily angered. It keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in evil, but rejoices with the truth. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. Love never fails. Now, everywhere we see the word love, let's replace it with God, because God is love. So let's read this verse of scripture again with the plug-in. God is patient. God is kind. God does not envy. God does not boast. God is not proud. God does not dishonor others. God is not self-seeking. God is not easily angered. God keeps no record of wrongs. God does not delight in evil, but rejoices with the truth. God always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. God never fails. Isn't that just beautiful and amazing? Now, this was written by Paul to the church in Corinth to teach them how to have a good relationship with one another. And if the Father asked us to love each other this way, how much more does He love us and empowers us to love? As we receive this revelation today, this fuller, understanding of the nature and heart of our Heavenly Father. I hope it helps you grow stronger in your faith and more in love with the one who loves you most. Be blessed.